I'm Robert Kauer. I'm a violin maker and restorer and dealer in Los Angeles. I think it's good in a profession to um, have something you don't know yet, to constantly learn. If you know everything, it becomes boring. It's important that you have calm hands and that you're very dexterous. It's actually helping if you can use both hands well. For instance, if you're ambidextrous, you can work better uh, doing the same thing in mirror image on the other side. It's good if you can play the violin. I much prefer violin makers who know how to play. You can analyze better what's, what's wrong with it and you can find problems by playing and try to fix them. If you always need somebody else who plays it for you, you don't have the same closeness to the instrument. You can't see as easily what's wrong. A musician will sometimes see his violin or cello almost like a child. Sometimes they even give them names. And it becomes a personal part of them. It's part of their life. They have an emotional attachment to it. The owner of a nice instrument will recognize his instrument, but he will look more holistic. He sees the whole instrument and will see, yes, that's mine, like you recognize that this is a photograph of your daughter. Sound is not really an objective thing, it's more subjective. Uh, what one person likes is not necessarily what somebody else likes. I guess it's similar to um, the way we select spouses. Uh, we have different tastes and we will like different things in a, in a partner. And this is almost like a partner.